Today's video is sponsored by Raid. It's lit. Just take a look at the drip. You boys look excited in this way. It's like a small truck. You want to catch all of the drip, drip, drip. So he usually is most active when you feed him. Okay. Like he's yeah. very food oriented. <laughs> I heard you wanted to be shocked. I do. Yes, he so I don't know if you will get. You probably just have to piss him off enough. I was just <laughs> unclogging the filter and he shocked the <laughs> out of me. So I've noticed he doesn't have a strong enough shock to kill the other fish. He has enough to frighten them. It's not like an electric uh, eel. They have a strong enough uh, shock to actually light a light bulb. This guy does not. He will. It's. Like, I, I heard it. Like, have you ever like? It, for a solid yeah. Night. Have you ever like put a battery to your tongue? Yeah. Like, you know. You know that that shock you get. That's the shock you get, but it's in your fingers. Bro. Yeah. You need to make a video attaching like cords to an electric eel and make it light a light bulb up. <laughs> or we you just find put it in the tank. Well, they put the positive and the negative of a stereo into the tank, and he can actually create the sound waves because he sends do frequencies. I don't know if they're legal in the uh, in Texas. Well, that no, does mean I can't care. get. <laughs> I will drive. Yeah. Okay. So, so he's gonna be somewhere up under here. Hopefully, I don't. Have him shock me. Oh, so just, I guess, start feeling around. Start feeling around. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm trying. Go find him. Oh, really? He's tiny. He's oh, right. I see him. I see him. He got you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <she's right>. oh. <laughs> no way, bro. It's it's more scary. Hey, do you want to turn on the light? He might be right under there still, or? No way. So how are we gonna get him out? A net. <laughs> that is rubber at the end of it. Okay. Oh, he's moved. Oh, oh god. I think he went over here. He's, yeah, he's right. He's out. right under this. Run oh, I see him. Oh, I saw him. I saw him too. Oh, he's oh right there, there is. Oh, bro, it looks like he could shock you. He didn't get you. He might have. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> you felt that? Oh my god! Yeah. Ow! I so they're yeah. they're kind of like a battery. They can store up the charge. It feels like and, a big battery. Yeah. So it, it's. It's not fun. Oh my god! Well, where'd you he go? charges up and then just. So it, it I don't know how it. fast they charge. I just. Where'd you go? I know that they they can store up to a certain capacity, kind of like a snake in their venom. Where'd Adults are better at controlling the amount they put out. He is kind of just like fuck all and just shocks everything he has at you. So he's definitely under the rocks. He's he's dug little caves and crevices. So y'all are moving. Is that what you're doing? Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, Hopefully. Colorado. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> he found him. He's over here. He's Dude, I want to get a look at him. Like, I want to scare him out to the front. Oh, bro. I'm bro. selling most of them. You are selling most of them? God. Yeah. Look at him. I'm you you can see him now. I, you can see him now. That's an electric like catfish. Chameleon I'm keeping. Oh. <laughs> that's, that's sick. Nate, you want to do pretty. it? He's pretty. He's... No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> that is dope. I love yeah. that thing. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, are we able to see? Like, are you able to give us like a little tour of your other stuff? Yeah. Okay. Then. Um. Let's start out here. Yeah. I got this tank. I have uh, some Ember Tetras in there. Uh, I just have seven. I have some Pygmy Quarries, a Nerite Snail. This beta is sick. Right? Yeah, that's a King Beta. That's tank. He's. How much did that cost? He's thirty dollars. Yeah. Thirty dollars. Well, I think it's kind of big. These are the, the Geico geckos. The go yeah. Oh! Yeah. Oh! This is a yeah. Geico gecko. Oh! 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 Larry. It looks like a small crocodile. Yeah, so that's a, a Nile monitor. So they're part of the water monitor species family, but this is like the most aggressive of them. I'm pretty sure they have some sort of bacteria in their mouth. It's so like a really Komodo dragon, which yeah, kills their prey because of bacteria. Yeah, that gets six, six feet? feet. So he's, he's not... Anything for beginners. He, oh, he's how big does this thing get? I believe three they feet. said three feet, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a big so shock. it was a big shock then? Yeah. <laughs> oh. big shock. yeah. Okay. I think there is a video of somebody moving one online and he it's like his whole body just kind of went to like a seizure, like a compulsion. <laughs> yeah. Can't wait like to buy him. Orange baboon tarantula. Where's that? <laughs> he's up here. Sorry, but hell no. <laughs> <laughs> what, it can kill you? Yeah, he's right there. Oh, he can go out the window. Oh, oh you can film. You can film. He can go out the window take, right it, now. take the camera. So he's right in there. Uh -huh. So it won't kill you. It's just going to make you want to die. Yeah, it, it's not It's not a, It's not a nice bite. He's yeah. not a big, so I don't know how uh, how bad it'll he be as a baby. I believe it's just as bad as an adult. Oh, oh, oh there is snakes. See, you would think you couldn't keep all this stuff in an apartment, but you just proved everybody wrong. So, <laughs> what's in here? There's just a, a right Texas toad. We can oh, we can turn him into Texas toast. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what, you just wait, what? 
I thought those were shoes. No. <laughs> that was oh, that was hi. Yeah. See, that's cool. So when we got them, they were probably <gasps> that big. So you, so you guys met at Peco? Yeah. So like Bumble, but Peco. Kind of. Different. <laughs> Are these just decorations or is there something in these? <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. You should get shocked by it. It's like it's like a battery. Like try it. It's it's wow. You know what you should do a video of when he's three foot long? Like he's uh, 24 hours in a bathtub with electric catfish. Oh my <laughs> god, yes! Nate asked me this earlier. Are these like genetically made or are they like No they're they're they're, they're, real. Real. they're real. I believe they're. Yeah, I was thinking like Asia. Asia or Thailand? Most well, can I can I grab them and put them in a bag? It's like fanatics coming tonight to get the catfish, and I'm like, take them with me. <laughs> we had a cooler, but that works way better. Yeah, he's he's out of juice at this point. I think we should. All right, corner him. Oh, oh, that one hurt. That one hurt. Okay, there he's. Oh. Yeah, okay, you got him. You got him. You got him. You got him. Oh, ow. Oh, ow. Ow, ow. That was good. That was that was worth it. I can feel my hand like vibrating. All right, little guy. You literally held it out of water in your hand. Turn no off. way. You legit have a pawn. I mean, you're doing it all. That's like clear. That's sick. Found him. Uh, there he is. There he is. Wow. This is bro. Like, this is sick. Bro. What if you guys like shot me through the bag? If I bro, feel that it. like <laughs> that actually shocked me. Out of like it hurt? Yeah. That hurt. That like I didn't. I. That's what exactly what I thought it was gonna be like. I now I need to get a metal rod and touch him and see if it amplifies. <laughs> We need him to grow. We need to feed him. We need, we need to go to that place. Thank you to them. I mean, they hooked it up. Their whole, they were, they were their whole place cool. was dope. Yeah, they were super cool. But no, legit, our little electric catfish. Uh, you guys comment some names down below. But yeah, I just got, I just got shocked. Straight up shocked. That was sick. All right, guys. Well, I'm back at home. Here he is in the flesh. Well, he's actually under that rock. And you guys are probably like, why did you put him in the goldfish tank? He hasn't touched them at all. He just went straight to that rock, and that's where he stays. But because I'm trying to get these goldfish to make babies, I'm going to move these goldfish into a bigger tank. Actually, possibly an indoor pool pond or a 100-gallon tank. Because I've been seeing some activity. Some, you know. You know what I mean. This guy's going to grow up in here for now. Once he gets big, probably going to end up going in here. Or a bathtub. But let's see if we can, uh, if I can lift this up. Oh. Oh, there he is. I don't know if he has any juice in him right now. Ow. Ow. Oh, my gosh. Well, that, that is him down there. You guys can see him a lot better now. I want to give you some good shots. But he's sitting under that pleco. There he is. Ow. But he kind of just hangs out. Like, it looks like something that would electrocute you, though. You see? And like right when I'm right here, I can feel like a like a little like field of energy. It's insane. And then he and then he gets you like that. <laughs> but he doesn't mess with any of the fish. So we're going to take this out, and we got to move all of this. Okay, so I'm actually going to leave the big ones in here for right now. So those two. And I'm just going to take out the three little guys that are down in there, and I'll close this up. And probably in a week or two, I'll take the big ones out. He is. I don't know if you guys can see. He's back underneath this piece of wood, but he's sick. I love it. Okay, so this is where these goldfish are going. And before anybody says it, because I know people are going to be like, no, you can't put those goldfish in there because they won't be able to get any food because they're the chubby ones and they don't swim fast. I have never seen that. I, uh, I've noticed these fish are always the first ones to the food, in my opinion. Uh, I don't know why, but if they end up having that problem in here, we can move them out. But I, I don't think they will. But let's acclimate them. All right, to Larry. I got him. I got him. And there's one. There he is. That actually makes a cool addition to the tank. And then this is probably the nicest one. That Yeah, that one's dope. That one's a super pretty one. Okay, yeah, that's perfect. Now that we took the tilapia out of here, I think we're going to drain this, refill it, and put the big ones in here in a few days. That Then that should be good. Right before I end today's video, though, today's video is sponsored by Raid. <laughs> Hi, I'm in the shower. Completely off topic, though. Uh, have you guys ever played an RPG game? Because I haven't. I've played something a lot better. Raid Shadow Legend is who today's video is sponsored by. You can play with me and Brenton at this username, right here. This is weird, this. this is yeah, this is weird. As you guys can see right here, I'm absolutely wrecking this guy. And I've never played a video game in my life. You wanna know why? Because Xbox, because Xboxes and Playstations are expensive. And I'm broke. I spent all my money on alpacas. Wow, look at all these sharks. All their abilities are so crazy. The graphics are just insane. How's that? <laughs> and the highly anticipated battle pass has arrived. The season one battle pass is here, and you can get things like energy refills and gems. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Legit, if you guys go to the link in the description and click on special links, and if you're a new player, you get 100,000 silver, two clan boss keys, 10 mystery shards, and one free champion executioner. And you can play it on your desktop too. By the way, the whole package I just mentioned, it's only available for the next 30 days. I suck at most games, 
and I, I don't suck at this one. So big thank you to Raid for sponsoring today's video. Like I said, link in the description. Come play with me. You might as well. So yeah, just hit you guys with an ad. Yeah, I know. But with that being said, if you guys did not know, 61.5% of you are not subscribed. So hit that subscribe button down below. There's the turtle. Oh, you see him? Oh, I don't know if you guys can see him. He He's down there. He, hi, Pickle Boots. Hit that subscribe button down below. Hit the like button and hit the notification bell as well. Like I said, it's quarantine season, boys and girls. Stay inside, wash your hands, stuff like that. Be safe. So with that being said, hopefully you guys went on to enjoy, and I will catch you next time on that next episode of Fanatic. Peace.